We don't have a lot of evergreen species in Wyoming, but lots of times they get confused quite easily. Next to me, we have a fir tree, but sometimes they get confused with spruce trees. When we look at a fir tree, we'll notice that the needles are by themselves, meaning it's just a single needle. The needles themselves are actually flat. And we also say that firs are friendly, meaning if you grab the needles, they really don't hurt your hand too much to grab them. Again, with the spruce tree, we'll find that the needles are singular. They are not in a group. When we put it in our hand, we can feel that it's more triangular in shape. And then when we go to shake it, we can feel that it's a little more pokey uh, as compared to the fir. Another common evergreen we find in our landscapes are junipers. Junipers actually don't have needles, but they have scales instead. With our pine species, we're actually going to find the needles that are in groups. They'll usually be in groups of two, three, or five. To get a better identification of the exact species, you'll also need to look at other factors for the pine trees, including the cones. There are different types of evergreens that work well in landscapes in Wyoming. Knowing what plants you are dealing with in your landscape is important for disease and management. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Brian Sebade, and you're watching From the Ground Up. Thank you.